All right, welcome back to World History with Mr. McCall. Well, today we're going to be dealing with hunters and gatherers during the Paleolithic and Neolithic Age. But specifically, our goal today is compare the lives of hunter-gatherers during the Paleolithic Age, the Old Stone Age, with the lives of people during the Neolithic Age, the New Stone Age. So what we have here are two pictures. One's the Paleolithic Age and one's the Neolithic Age. Give you some time to think about which one you think is which. All right, and now let's go ahead and discuss that. Now, I would call this one our Neolithic age, and let me explain why. Because if you look at this home, this has a lot of work here. This is uh, a cross-section of what the house looks like. Uh, it's, it's very big. And the word that is important to remember here is this is a permanent shelter. Whereas when we look over here, uh, this is a temporary shelter. This is something that they could collapse very easily. Uh, if the animals they were following uh, moved or uh, migrated, they could very easily collapse this and follow the herd. So we have here Paleo, we have here Neo. This one they're farming, this one they're hunting and gathering. All right, so let's take a look at our lesson today. We're going to compare. So we're going to compare the two. We have the Paleolithic and the Neolithic. Now, before we do anything, we need to talk about some similarities. So let's talk about some similarities that they both have. Well, they're both humans, right? I mean, still humans, they're just living differently. Uh, they, they have to eat. Eat to survive. They have families. They have communities. They have homes. Hunters and gatherers had homes. They were just easily collapsible and could be easily moved. Whereas in the Neolithic times, once they have farms, they decide they're going to stay put because they don't have to worry about where their food's going to come from. All right, so now let's discuss the difference between these two. First off, let's start with Paleolithic. They were hunters and gatherers. That is how they got their food. Hunted animals and gathered plants, fruit, vegetables, stuff along those lines. They were nomadic. If you're a hunter and gatherer, it's probably best for you to be nomadic because your food might move. Or it might change with the seasons. Uh, they were nomadic, so they generally followed the herd, the group of animals. Uh, they found new plants to eat. Uh, any all time was dedicated to trying to find food. I'm going to put pretty much all time. Pretty much always looking for food. All right, so we've got our Paleolithic people. Now let's talk about our Neolithic people. Now, how were they different? Well, Neolithic people were generally farmers. They had at least someone in their community that was doing the farming. If you think of our culture, we're more like the farmers because we do have people in our civilization that farm for us. It's just we don't all farm. All right, now let's see. They had a stable food supply. Because they had farmers and people that were 
doing the, the farm work and getting the food, they didn't have to worry about where the food was going to come from. It was right around the corner. So because they had a stable food supply, they were able to build permanent shelters. When we looked at that original picture, we saw that their homes were going to stay there for a long time. They weren't going to pick up and move. Now, because they had a lot of people with permanent shelters and not everybody had to do the farming, they had different jobs. So people started to focus on different things. And more importantly, I'm going to put this in front of that, there was more free time. There was more free time for people to do different jobs, to do different things to experiment with art, to experiment with music and all kinds of other things that lead to civilization. All right, well, that's it. That's what I wanted to do today. I wanted to compare the lives of humans during the Paleolithic times and the Neolithic times. Hope this was edifying. Take care.